Irving Ramsey Wiles, born in 1861 in Utica, New York, was an American artist who made significant contributions to the field of grand manner portraiture. Wiles was a prominent figure in the early 20th century, following in the footsteps of renowned artists such as John Singer Sargent, Giovanni Boldini, and James Whistler. He embraced their redefined American grand manner portraiture style, which gained popularity in late 19th century Europe. Alongside artists like John White Alexander and Cecilia Bowes, Wiles focused on capturing the essence of the American leisure class in his portraits. Despite a decline in interest in his work over time, Wiles' paintings continue to be showcased in esteemed institutions such as the De Young Museum, the Metropolitan Museum of Art, the National Gallery in Washington, D.C., and the Smithsonian American Art Museum. His enduring presence in these institutions is a testament to his lasting impact on the art world. Irving Ramsey Wiles, born on April 8, 1861, in Utica, New York, was a renowned American painter. He received his early artistic education from his father, Lemuel M. Wiles, and later studied at the Art Students League of New York and in Paris under Carolus Duran. Wiles began his career as an illustrator and later gained fame for his portraiture, especially among America's elite. He became a member of the Society of American Artists and the National Academy of Design. Wiles also excelled in male portraiture and was selected to paint portraits for a pictorial history of World War I. In his later years, he focused on plein air landscapes and seascapes. Wiles passed away in Pekinick, New York, on July 29, 1948. During his career, Irving Ramsey Wiles created a wide range of artworks, showcasing his versatility and talent. One of his notable works is, Her Leisure Hour, painted in 1925, which captures the grace and elegance of a woman in a leisurely moment. Another notable piece is, Brown Kimono, portrait of Catherine Beta La Fourque, from 1908, showcasing his skill in portraiture. Wiles also painted landscapes such as, Pekinick Bay, depicting the natural beauty of his home in Pekinick. Additionally, his still-life paintings, such as, Still Life with Vase and Plate, and, Still Life with Lusterware and Peaches, demonstrate his attention to detail and composition. Irving Ramsey Wiles's artistic career spanned several decades, and he left a lasting impact on the art world. His portraits, characterized by their elegance and attention to detail, captured the essence of his subjects. Notable figures, including Theodore Roosevelt and William Jennings Bryan, sat for his portraits. Wiles's talent extended beyond portraiture, as he also excelled in landscapes and still-life paintings. His dedication to plein air painting allowed him to capture the beauty of nature in his works. Despite facing financial difficulties in his later years, Wiles continued to create art until his passing. His contributions to the art world and his influence on future generations of artists make him an important figure in American art history. To sum up, Irving Ramsey Wiles was a versatile and influential American painter who left a lasting impact on the art world. His ability to capture the essence of his subjects in his elegant and detailed portraits made him a sought-after artist among America's elite. Wiles' talent extended beyond portraiture, as demonstrated by his skill in landscapes and still-life paintings. His dedication to plein air painting allowed him to beautifully depict the natural beauty of his surroundings. Despite facing financial difficulties, Wiles continued to create art until his passing, leaving behind a rich legacy in American art history.